Hey, middle schoolers, remember how when I came into history class, I said you might use this page for other research? Well, that's what you're going to do in language arts class. If you didn't bookmark this page, remember we quickly got to it by typing in bit.ly slash capital BSD MS dash research. And that's going to get you to this page. And you have been reading different historical fiction books. And so when you look at your book and you think like, how could I do research about this time period? I'll give you a few ideas of which sources to go to. So remember some of the ones that we looked at before were like the Gale eBooks here. That, that would be a great one. The middle school one here, or maybe even down here, the US history. So if I was doing some research on mouse, I actually pulled up uh, one of the Gale eBooks and just typed in Auschwitz and found all kinds of information here. And look at even over on the side, it gives you like other things you could research. So if you wanted to research <coughs> prisoners of war or different concentration camps, this would be a great place to go. Don't forget that any of your articles you can save to Google Drive. Remember that? So what if you uh, read Out of the Dust uh, by Karen Hess and you were studying the Great Depression in the Oklahoma Dust Bowl? Well, I just went on one of the ebooks here and I typed in Dust Bowl and it gave me a bunch of different books that I could choose from. But it was talking about like when it happened, what was happening during this time period and um, gives you all different information and also once again some related subjects so you can get more um, if you're having a hard time reading some of the content don't forget you can listen to it too what if you chose to read um, sunrise over fallujah well this is more of a current uh not as historical as some of the other ones this happened during the persian gulf war and so i did a search on operation iraqi freedom because in the book that's what they talked about the name of the um the program they were in and so notice how i put quotes around all three words to force all the words together and this would be a great place again where you could get some information about this time period <clears throat> what was happening in the war during that time. Don't forget to save it to Google Drive. And I know some of you also chose Chains as your option of the book that you read. And remember, this takes place during the Revolutionary War. And we already did some research on that in eighth grade. So in this particular case, I actually went to the middle school or the US history. Those would be good options. And I typed in Revolutionary War Spies and I came up with some different articles. And I found this one article, I thought this would be good. Um, it's from an actual magazine instead of a reference books. And it talks a little bit about some of the other spies of the Revolutionary War. And this is a, that was a fictional account in chains, but uh, here are some real people and maybe you could do some research on that. So best of luck, and I'm sure the Middle School Library resource page um, is going to be super helpful for you. Uh, remember, another way you can get there is by going to uh, ACMA, our page, and then go to Academics and Library. And once you get onto the library page, just make sure you click on Start Research, and that will get you back to the library pages. All right, best of luck. I'm sure you'll do great.